Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and cheap coins, check out instantmudcoins.com and use code ZERK for 20% off. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing, what, what, wobbing, what, what, wobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing, what, what. What's going on guys? It's Zerx coming at you today with another YouTube video and today EA just tweeted out both heroes for all of the NFC teams. Now I don't believe they show any of the lower cards. I'm not sure if there are any other lower cards. I'd imagine that there are but they only showed the 295 overall heroes for each team. If you guys didn't know the playoff promo uh, there is an, a 95 overall offensive and a 95 overall defensive player for every single team that is in the playoffs. So if you missed my video from this morning, if you're curious about half of the AFC players, I have it in the video this morning. Now, I do want to give a shout out to Michael R for being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys want a chance to be shout out in the next video, drop a like in the vid. Make sure you guys are subbed to the channel. Turn the notification bell on and comment down below Nota Gang. Also, make sure you guys spam up that like button. If you guys don't follow me over on Twitter, by the way, you definitely need to follow me over on Twitter as well as TikTok and Instagram, all at Xerxy. Go hit your boy with a follow and also make sure you guys just throw the like button. Let's go ahead and get to this. As I said, they have tweeted out all of the NFC players. And also, there is one other thing that I want to show you guys because we actually already know who the master is, or at least one of the masters. I believe they said there's only one master, or at least what Kralos said this morning. So uh, we at least know one of the masters. If there are going to be multiple, we know one of them. So I'm going to get into that after I show you guys all these. But you can see this Mitchell Trubisky here. Uh, he actually was a card that was revealed this morning. I'm going to, you know, just quickly go over any cards that were revealed earlier today. Uh, but Mitch Trubisky, not a bad card at all. But as for the Bears, other player, we have got Akeem Hicks. He's only got 65 speed, but he has 82 excel. He's got 96 strength, 95 tackling, 96 barrack, 96 block shit, and a 94 power move. Actually, not a bad card, but I mean, the speed is like really, really bad. I mean, if he had good speed, this would be a super good card. But block shit, power move, really good strength. It, it's like a really good card until you see the speed, basically. So, eh. Yeah, is what it is there. Robert Woods, though, is the Rams' other 95 overall player. He's got 93 speed, 90 jumping, 96 catch, 94 catch in traffic, 92 spec catch. Uh, really, really good route. So, you know, pretty solid card. He is a route running archetype. So Rams themed teams, going to be really good there. And next up, we have Tom Brady, which Tom Brady was, of course, already revealed earlier this morning. So again, quick little glance at his stats, you guys can see. Uh, and no, he doesn't get Gunslinger. So kind of unfortunate there, but no Gunslinger for Tom Brady. The other player, though, looks really really good and again i just wish they gave him 94 zone man because this card would be so crazy but he does have 94 speed and 95 excel 95 hit power 93 zone 86 man 92 pursuit 85 tackling and 93 player like antoine winfield jr really 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 nice looking card uh and as i said i just really wish they gave him 94 zones so that way he could get up to 99 and again i want to emphasize here as well these players don't look to have power ups so i don't think that the set are actually like the set players are actually gonna give you uh like the power ups for them i don't think you're gonna get the power ups if there is in fact a set for these guys because they haven't shown like any sets or anything I don't believe we're going to get power-ups for them because some of these players don't have them. Uh, if he does get a power-up, though, down the road, we're talking about 94 zone, which means lockdown maxed out. You can get him to 99. Incredible card, but he actually may just be like a really, really, really good middle linebacker user. Got to see his change of direction tomorrow. Uh, but Alex Smith. Now, Alex Smith is a 95 overall field general with 95 throw power. Which means that Alex Smith will actually get Gunslinger. So I believe he's one of the only ones, maybe even the only one here that actually does get Gunslinger. So Alex Smith will have Gunslinger and Hiram Master. Uh, he's got 85 speed, 93 short, 91 medium, 89 deep. So you will need to run go deep on him to get that deep accuracy over 90. Uh, but I mean, you have the best abilities right there. Gunslinger and Hara Master, great card for Alex Smith, and Landon Collins, another card that was revealed this morning, he's got 93 speed, 95 excel, 90 zone, 96 hit power on him, again, another guy that you could probably run at middle linebacker, probably pretty solid there, DK Metcalf, another guy that was revealed this morning, he's got 95 speed, 95 jumping, 92 catch, 94 catch in traffic, 94 spec catch, 93 short, 90 medium, and 93 deep, really, really good looking card there as well, uh, the other player for the Seahawks is Jerron Reed, uh, he's got 73 speed, 87 excel, 90 85 strength only an 85 block shed but really really good uh finesse move there at 94 so eh not a big fan of the card there uh teron armstead another guy that was already revealed this morning and offensive lineman so no you know real need to stop and look at the stats for too long but marcus williams again he does have a power up which is good but another safety that can't get to 99 zone and i'm really emphasizing 99 zone because there are so many safeties in the game right now that can get to 99 zone coverage that have really good speed 
that I feel like it's kind of essential right now. Uh, but again, Marcus Williams, you know, really good speed, 94 speed, 95 excel. He's got 86 hit power, 92 zone, and 84 man. So we can't get 99 zone, can't get 90 man coverage, but really, really speedy. So, I mean, it's it's a solid card there. David Bakhtiari here for the Packers. No surprise that he ended up getting a card. 90 strength, 96 awareness, 96 pass block. Not very good at run blocking there. Kenny Clark, I actually forgot to show him this morning. He has 71 speed and 83 excel, 95 strength, 95 block shed, and 92 power move and i believe that is all the cards oh and also jalen ramsey i i think i accidentally skipped over that but jalen ramsey is in fact the rams player and just a quick little run through to make sure that i showed you guys every single player but i believe that in fact was everybody david bakhtiari kenny clark right there and i think that was everyone and it seems to be everybody so those were all the NFC cards were revealed, but as I said, I did actually reveal half of the AFC cards in this morning's video. So if you want to go ahead and check it out, you guys are more than welcome to go ahead and check that video out. The rest of the AFC cards, though, we will know tomorrow. However, the Ultimate Team Insider account actually posted this on their Instagram a while ago. I think it was like a couple hours ago. And in case you guys can't decrypt this, it does say Ice Up Sun, which is, of course, Steve Smith's catchphrase. So it looks like we are going to be getting a playoff master Steve Smith. However, EA has not tweeted out the player yet, so I don't have like any stats to showcase for you guys. I don't even know if they're going to be tweeting out the player at all, but it does look like the playoff master because Kralo did say this morning we had one master. It looks like it's probably going to be Steve Smith. Now they did say this promo is going to be a multiple drop promo, guys. So I don't know how they're going to be doing the drops here, seeing as to how they haven't shown us any lower overall players. So I think what we may see tomorrow is going to be all the 95 overalls. And then like at a later point, maybe like Saturday or something or Sunday, maybe I'm not quite sure, or even sometime this upcoming week, they will drop a bunch of the lower overall players. That's kind of what we're used to with the playoff promos, having these 95 overalls with sets with, you know, like a 93, 91, 89, 87, 85, whatever. So I don't really know what's going to be going on that. We don't know any Anything yet about the sets we don't know if there's gonna be any solos i would imagine there's gonna be some sort of solo challenges some sort of sets but with the way that they're revealing stuff they haven't revealed any of the lower overall guys so i'm not sure how the sets work or anything as well as solo challenges more than likely if there was some solos we get like a 93 not like a free 95 overall player but maybe we'll get lucky maybe they're feeling really really generous and they'll give us a pack that gives us a free 95 overall player that would be pretty awesome, but it does look like we have playoff master Steve Smith Sr. Obviously, this is for Steve Smith, Ice Up Sun, and he already does have a legend card, so it's not like they're just trying to, like, early tease the legend for Saturday, because it's not going to be him. He already has an LTD legend, so we're probably going to be getting a playoff master, or we will be getting a playoff master Steve Smith on top of all these cards, but I guess we'll see tomorrow exactly how they're going to be doing it with the set solos, if there's any lower players, when the players going to be dropping, are they dropping half the AFC and NFC players tomorrow? I don't know how they're doing it, but I hope you guys did enjoy the video, and if you did, make sure to drop a like on the video, and of course, hit that sub button down below. I will see you guys in the morning with a playoff promo kind of recap, going over the set, solos, all the players, everything like that. Very exciting stuff. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy the video, and if you did, make sure to drop a like on it, and of course, hit that sub button down below. I'll see you guys next time.